All right, Fox, uh, something a little different today. Uh, I've seen people on the internet where they put candy, like in vodkas or, you know, whatever, uh, and then they let it sit for a long time, uh, you know, see what flavor it comes out as. So uh, I thought, I thought I'd give it a try. So I got some of these uh, Werther's, uh, what is Werther's, caramel? Caramel or butterscotch? I think it's caramel. And we're going to put these in the jar. Uh, we're just going to do about like that. Uh, and, you know, vodka is just one of those things. I love, I love the flavored vodkas. And I love vodka in, you know, a lot of different drinks. It's just not one of those things I'm going to sit around and do shots in, of and that sort of thing. If it's shots, it's probably going to be tequila, whiskey, or maybe some of the flavored whiskeys. So we're just going to pour, and I just got this Freeze Vodka. I think it's a little bit cheaper brand. Uh, I was going to take that off there, but I don't know. My... There we go. So just fill this up. Like I said, I mean, vodka is okay for mixed drinks. It's just not, it's not something I'm going to do a bunch of shots of uh, normally. But uh, yeah, just fill this jar up most of the way. Put this in here. And we'll let it set for a week. We did the vodka with the Werther's. I put about 25 or 30 in here. It's been about a week, uh, six days. So we're gonna give it a try. Um, I'm a little nervous about it because I don't really know. It can't taste bad, I wouldn't think, but. I mean, it smells good. It smells like Caramel vodka. All right, here we go. Bottoms up, tops down. Oh my God! That is awesome. That is great. That's 10 out of 10. See you guys.